So Poppy is probably like, what's that, the abominable snowman? <laughs> How are you doing, Lewis? Oh, your dog found a friend, huh? <laughs> How's everything? Good, good, good. Let me see what Bodhi is up to. So Bodhi is way over there. Yeah, he caught you off guard and he's over there looking for gophers. Oh yeah. You know what? Okay, so now he's also looking for lizards too. Oh lizards too? Yeah, lizards. He he's focusing more these days on lizards and birds. Yeah. So not so much the golfers anymore. There's nothing to hunt around here. He's looking for whatever he can hunt. Right. Even candy. Remember he? he oh yeah, he true. Was pointing at that one, uh, one little candy on the side. Or <laughs> he was doing a pointing thing, you know, like I found something. Oh, in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. So so that tree over there, he found a lizard there maybe yeah. about a week or two ago. And ever since then, he keeps going over through that tree looking for something. Yeah. Well, he sure does his job, doesn't he? I mean, that's a pretty red one. Right. Bodhi, come on, this way. Bodhi, come. Come on, Bodhi, let's go. Bye, Bye, take care. Zuma, you coming back soon? Okay. Oh, Zuma. Oh, Zuma. We got to get her back in shape a little bit. Oh, really? Oh, she wasn't doing much over at the other house, huh? Yeah, we got to Okay. Run her around the backyard. Right. Okay, bye. Have a nice evening. All right, good see you. You too. Bodie. Bodhi, come on. Come on, Bodhi. Let's go. Let's go, Bodhi. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get it. Good boy. Oh, I dropped it. Okay, thank you. Bodhi, you ready? You ready? You ready? Get it. Good boy. The the Kong one is mine, so. Oh, oh, that one's yours. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, I just found it out in the dog park. I wasn't aware it was no, yours. No, it's all good. Oh, okay. Baldy, come on. Let's find you a ball, okay? Come on.
Yeah, I saw that gentleman I, I was talking to. I wasn't aware that was this dog's toy or ball, I should say, because balls are just all over this dog park and they get left in here. Like there's one right there. Here's the softball over here. So yeah, so they're just all over, so. So yeah, I didn't know it was his. Hey, Bodie, come on. Come on, get it. Good boy. Good boy. All right, drop it. Drop it. No. Drop it. Ready? 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 Get it. Good boy. Good boy, Bodhi. All right, drop it. Hey. Hey. No. No. Drop it. Good boy. Good boy. Didn't even have to ask you to sit, huh? Ready? 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 Get it. Good boy. So the white dog over here this one right here is a great Pyrenees. His name is Bone. And I think he's a little bit over a year old. I think that's how old he is. Let me see, where are the owners again? If I can track them down, I'll ask them. Let's see. Hey Jason, how old is Bone? A year and ten months, so almost two years old. Oh, you don't want to do that. Yeah, this Belgian Malinois is gorgeous. He's huge, too. So I featured him in a previous video. His name is Bigfoot, although he has a Spanish name, but I forget the Spanish name. Let me see, maybe I can ask the owner again. Let me see, where is he? Maybe that's him over there in the corner. Hey, I know your dog's name is Bigfoot, but he actually has a Spanish name, right? Yeah. Uh, what's, so what's his Spanish name? Patotas. Pat, patotas. Uh -huh. But we call him Totas. Totas. Like short for Bigfoot. Okay. 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 See, I always thought, like, Big was grande, or that's more large. Yeah. Okay. Well, um, Patas are, like, uh, feet. Okay. And then Big Feet are uh, Patotas. Patotas. Okay. How about how the dogs been over here? They been all right? No. Yeah, they're doing okay. Um, no incidents. I was I was surprised how many dogs were in here today. Yeah. Kind of surprised, you know, because it's actually a pretty warm day. You know, yeah. not as bad as yesterday. Yesterday was pretty humid. But I think it's uh, just some park over there by uh by South Hills. Okay. Okay. And yeah, there's uh, some pit bulls. Some pit bull got vicious and he started like attacking another dog. Really? And I just grabbed my dog and I just got in the car and left. Oh wow! Wow. Yeah. So the, the the dog park in South Hills, where's that located? Uh, 
I'm not sure if it's a dog park, but it was just, there's like a lot of dogs there. Oh, I see. It's right off of the, the 57, off the 10 freeway. Okay. And um, are you going to Raging Waters? Right. Oh, oh, okay, okay. That sounds like the one in San Dimas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. And, um, well, yeah, well, you know, but, uh, for a while, but, uh, we ain't, we weren't having it. I thought that. Yeah, I've heard some pretty good things about that dog park, but then also at the same time, I think that there's a, like a rattlesnake issue there too. Yeah. So, yeah, you just got to be on the lookout because that's right over there by, isn't it over over there kind of close to Benelli Park, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so they, I know they do have rattlesnakes over there. What about, uh, you know, the hiking trail right there off the six, uh, 60 freeway on 7th 60 Avenue? Freeway. Yeah, I'm not. I don't know if you're you mean, there, but like it's... up in like, uh, is it Hacienda Heights or something? Yeah, like yeah, that? Hacienda Heights. Okay, I've heard of it. Yeah, it's bad. It's it's, it's, it's bad. Um, I went with them uh, all the way up there. Yeah. But they had a, a caution sign too about rattlesnakes. Okay. Yeah. 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 Basically, uh, basically, anytime you get away from you know like this area where it's more like the suburb area, then yeah, you encounter the rattlesnakes like. Santa Fe Dam is pretty nice up there too, but they got, they have a rattlesnake issue over there too. Yeah. And there there's coyotes around here or something like that. Oh yeah, I've seen them in this field over here. Uh, yeah, and the thing is, they have no fear of humans. They have zero fear of humans, so... I don't know, if, if, somebody, has a, <laughs> if somebody has a small dog, I would advise they don't go into this field yeah. at night because that coyote, I've heard stories of Coyotes actually snatching small dogs off the leash when people are walking them. Yeah, so I've been so I've been in in this dog park at night. This this is probably like a year and a half or two years ago. I was standing near that fence. The coyote came like right past this fence. Yeah, because uh, my my uh, my uncle plays a uh, Sunday baseball right here. Okay. And he told me he's like, yeah, there's a uh, coyotes around here. I was like, what? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, well, a lot of people don't know. Okay, so this is all fenced in, but the thing is, a coyote can scale like a six, seven foot fence easily. Easily, so. So yeah, even around here, if, if somebody has a small dog, don't let them out into the backyard like alone at night. Yeah. Because they will actually jump over a wall and snatch that pet. Oh, yeah, even raccoons too, man, raccoons. Yeah. I'm trying to get like his attention. Okay. I want to meet that dog over there. That dog just came in, huh? Yeah. yeah the phrase that I use with him, he don't, he don't, he don't do food. He does. Oh. Uh, okay. Like um, like if I play with him around, like. like uh, right. Okay. Like tug, like tug, tug in a little bit with them. Okay. That's what he likes as his, uh, <laughs> like as his, like, right. Yeah. Hold that, come here. Hey, come here. Come here. Hey, hey, hey. Hold that. Hold that. Hey. Hold that. Bodhi, come on. Bodhi, come. Come on. Let's go. Let's get the ball. Let's get it, huh? Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Get it. Good boy.
I don't care if they're tall. It's just, it's, 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 they have a nice face. <laughs> Nice looking Dober man. Yeah, I don't think I've seen him. Beautiful dog though. I believe he's pretty young too. Bobby. Hey. Come on, let's wrap this video, huh? Bodhi, come. Come on, Bodhi, let's go. Let's wrap the video up. Good boy. Hey, sit. No way. Stay. Okay, so that's going to draw this video to a close. Bodhi and I, we want to thank everyone for watching. If you can, please give the thumbs up. Also, leave a comment or question down below. If you make it short, we'll try to include it in an upcoming video. Also, if you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Make sure your notification bell is on. Uh, let's see here. A big thank you to everyone who watches the ads that helps support Bodhi. And everyone who's pressed the thanks button and has donated to Bodhi. We appreciate that also. Before, before we go, we want to read off a few names of people who watched previous videos and left comments. Roberta Joh Joheka. I hope I said that right. Lorna McKenzie. Uh, Lucas Wolf 72, Latanya Smith, Paula Abrams, Trideka 44, Jimmy Martin, Diane, Sydney Travelers. Thank you so much for watching. And a few of your comments uh, that were left, I'll read a few of those. Uh, Whispering Thylacine says, I don't understand why people bring mean dogs to the park. Well, you know what? It happens every once in a while where there is a dog with a behavioral issue, issue but uh, usually that's not the case. There aren't too many mean dogs out there. Uh, Whispering Thylacine, thank you so much for that uh, comment. Diane says, Chase is just a big, beautiful puppy who wants to play with all the other dogs. Uh, let's see here. Yay for Magnificent. Doby ears flopping in the wind. That's a comment from Diane. Diane, thank you so much for your comment. Hope you're doing well. Latanya Smith says, do you know is Lady Spade? Uh, yes, I do believe uh, that she is. Vicky Stowe says, hi, my good boy, Bodie. Hey, Jeff, that Pitbull mix has beautiful colors. He is so cute. Okay, the video that Vicky So is referring to is called Pitbull Mix with Rare Colors Visits Dog Park. I'll put a link at the end of the video. So if you want to check that video out, it's called Pitbull Mix with Rare Colors Visits Dog Park. So uh, thank you to everyone for watching. Thank you for all your comments. Really appreciate you. Thank you to everyone who gives the, gives the thumbs up. Also, if you have friends who like dogs, Share Bodhi's world with them. So until next time, Bodhi and, Bodhi and I, we hope we'll see you on the next episode. Everyone, take care.